This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Good morning from Central Oregon, living and homesteading. So apparently, while Sherry's been working her wonderful project here, uh, now we're discovering all kinds of stuff, but it looks like it's going to be a weed whacking day. Uh, for you. <laughs> <laughs> for me, yeah. So, uh, a lot of the tall grass, this is what we're fighting to try to get these new beds opened up again. And uh, Sherry's creating quite the uh, burn pile over here. So uh, we're actually thinking we might want to get a wood chipper, which would be great for the gardens. So I don't know. But anyway, today is a weed whacker day. Yep. And, and uh, I'm going to tackle that tree next. Wow. So this tree right here. Yeah. Looks like that one. <laughs> it's like that one. So, this is an olive tree, right? Yep. Look at this thing. A beautiful tree once you got it all cleaned up. But it just totally covered up the whole garden. Yeah. So, uh, oh yeah, she's getting this all opened up and pretty. And uh, now we're just going to hit some of this grass and stuff. And she's going to tackle this tree, but. Uh, it's kind of terrifying because there's a big spider in it. I know there's a big spider in there. <laughs> I don't like spiders. <laughs> yeah, I, I like to see spiders first before they find me. Yep. But uh, anyway, but it's a it's a harmless spider, but they're just creepy. It's just big. <laughs> <laughs> what do they call those? Cat face. Cat face spiders. Look those up. Uh, they're amazing. They make really nice... very beautiful spider webs. Yeah. I just don't want them on my body or be around them. Because <laughs> <laughs> they're creepy. So anyway, uh, let's get going. Go. So Sherry's request to do some uh, weed whacking is okay. However, the weed whacker we have, which is Sherry's father's old weed whacker, has an attitude. So let's see if we can get it started. So, uh, I actually used up all the string on the weed eater, but I found some more and we got it reloaded. But, I gotta tell you, Sherry's project here is actually humongous right now. So, this is all cut out from here. And it's actually created, well, there was a path here before, <laughs> it's back. And then you can see, Two giant piles of just pretty much olive tree and uh, these things uh, got spines on them and uh, they're bare to move around and we got to take them all the way over there to our burn pile way back there but uh, we got this all cut out and uh, look at this thing so this was the olive tree, which grew out of another olive tree at the base. Um, insane. Stuff really grows. There's another olive tree here. Ouch. And uh, we might leave it there to let it flourish a little bit. Um, 
but we got several olive trees on this property so uh don't be sad if you say oh it's too bad there's uh we've got several several olive trees so we're really starting to think about a wood chipper um i don't know we could uh benefit a lot from the chips and uh it's a big investment we'll have to think about that but anyway guys that's how you kind of show you our sherry's project which is huge you know i've been doing a lot of little things but um she's she's taking on a monster here so we're, we're getting there so she's very pink today too got uh the new uh, rototiller in it's an earthquake uh, it's a 90 99 cc uh not a super big one uh, i want something that sherry can handle too our dirt isn't that hard to work with the only big problem with this thing is uh it requires assembly and when it's really hot out it's not much fun to do assembly and uh the directions are insane and of course it's all matrix so anyway uh i'm getting it together slowly but surely but uh there's something to say about picking up a rototiller that's already been assembled in the store <laughs> so anyway uh let's get this thing together and see where we go from there and just like that it's all put together two hours later so uh it wasn't too bad uh the directions were kind of vague but uh they even sent oil with it that's kind of odd anyway guys that's our new rototiller it's an earthquake and uh in future videos we'll show you us uh, starting to use tear up the new garden all right guys i want to thank you for watching Please take the time to like and subscribe and share our videos all over the whole wide world. And uh, we'd love to hear your comments. And uh, please help uh, make our uh, channel grow. We appreciate your help. Talk to you later. Bye. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. Thanks.